another of the generalized principles would be principles of wave behavior. Throw a stone in the water and you got the most beautiful wave. See a circle emanate like that and then that, even though there's another big wave coming, it had an integrity all of its own. Let's identify man to start off with as what I call a pattern integrity. And I like to make clear what I mean by pattern integrity. I'm going to take a piece of, of manila rope and then I'm going to splice into it a piece of cotton rope. Splice in the other end of the cotton rope a piece of, of nylon rope. I'm going to make the very simplest knot that I know, which is simply to go around like 360 degrees in this plane, 360 degrees in that plane. I'm not going to pull it tight. There's that knot where the, the rope has not done this. I have done it to the to the rope. Then right, I can slide this knot right along. It's still a loose knot. I haven't pulled it tight. I slide it along on the rope. And now it leaves the manila, and now it's on the cotton. Now I keep sliding it along. Now it's on the nylon. So it's all, suddenly it's off the end. We say, the knot, the knot was a pattern integrity. It wasn't manila. It wasn't cotton. It wasn't nylon. It, though, cotton and nylon and manila, any one of them are good to let us know about its shape what his pattern was, but they, it was not that. It, was, it had an integrity in its own. We drop a stone in the water, and a most beautiful circular wave emanates. And, and I then try it in, in milk, and it works as well. I try in kerosene, so I discover that that wave is a pattern integrity. And then the next thing that uh, I try is say, I'd like to know about that. That wave apparently isn't just water, and it isn't milk. And so then I try sprinkling sawdust all over the water. Very neatly, a beautiful film of, of sawdust. Then I drop one piece of red popcorn on it, and I put a transit and, and a moving picture camera very carefully aimed at that red popcorn. We drop the stone over here in the water, and the yellow sawdust makes a wave, and suddenly the red popcorn goes out from the center of the earth, into the center of earth, comes right back where it was. They simply went in and out towards the center of Earth to accommodate the waves and let it go by, just as a piece of rope accommodated the knot sliding along on it.